Hello everyone and welcome to another edition of New Tech Tuesday Tutorials. I am your host Richard Evans. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe to our channel and today is a big announcement day. Today I am very pleased to announce the release of the NDI HX camera app for Android. Ta-da! This application allows you to turn the front and rear facing camera of your Android device into a wireless NDI source to use in your productions. Let me show you how to get it and how to use it. All right, so the first thing I want to show you is where to download the NDI HX application. So you'll just go into the Google Play Store. And in the top of the screen here, just type in NDI HX camera, which I've already searched for. And it'll be the first one on the list here from New Tech Inc. Boom. Now this application is going for $19.99, and it will give you all of the capabilities of using an NDI camera on your phone. So, or Android device. Okay, so now let's go over and find that application. So I have it installed over here. Uh, go ahead and launch NDI HX camera and let's take a look at some of the details of it. All right, so this is the NDI HX camera application here. All right, so let's go ahead and what I'm gonna do next is let me click on the icon in the bottom right corner, which will give you all of the different options for our NDI camera here. All right, and let me flip it around here so you can see me a little bit prettier than my desk here. <laughs> okay, so over here in the bottom left, you're gonna see this. This is where we're gonna have options to increase the brightness of our phone camera settings. All right, uh, and then you can also turn the flash on on the other side of your camera. So there, well, oh, it's blinding me now. Uh, you can also click on this grid here next to the NDI logo and that's going to let you be able to adjust your shots a little bit better so you can frame things. Uh, this NDI logo in the middle, basically whenever you have that turned on, that means that you're going to be able to be broadcasting. So when it's blue, you're broadcasting. When it's gray, that means it is not broadcasting. All right, and then this button over here on the side will toggle the microphone to be on or off. And then this button here will just basically allows you to switch your camera sources. So you can use the front and rear facing cameras. Uh, and then also you'll see here that this little speed dial here in the corner, that is going to be uh, settings so you can set your uh, NDI application to be broadcasting in uh, either low, medium, or high quality depending on the network that you have, etc. Uh, and then you can also use these uh, controls over here on the left to zoom in. Or you can just use the, the pinch method by using your fingers here and zooming into my face here. Awesome. Okay, so now let's go ahead and move over to the TriCaster and see how this little video feed works and how to bring it in. All right, so now I'm in my TriCaster TC1 interface, and all I have to do to connect these pieces of equipment is make sure that my TriCaster and my Android device are connected to the same network. And then after that, just make sure that your app is running, click that blue button, and then let's go into the TriCaster and click on the settings for my input number two here. And I'll go down my source drop down and find my Android device, which is sitting here on my desk, my Pixel 3. Connect to that, and boom, you are good to go. So Android users, rejoice. This application is going to open so many new and creative ways to use your Android devices in your productions via the power of NDI. Now, if you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe button on our YouTube page, youtube.com slash newtechinc, for more nuggets of new tech wisdom. And for more information on new tech products and services, please contact your local reseller or you can visit our website at newtech.com. Also, check out newtech.tv where we will talk about new product announcements, interviews with new tech users, third party developers, and much more. And if you're posting photos of your work on social media, tag us by using the hashtags newtech or tricaster. We see all of these posts and love to see what you're working on. Thank you again for watching and we will see you next time on New Tech Tuesday Tutorials.